Welcome to another video for Global Scholarships for International Students and we're going to keep on going with MIT and we're going to look at today applying for MIT Graduate Scholarships for Internationals. So after looking at the undergraduate scholarships, we're going to look at graduate scholarships. First, we're going to search for MIT scholarships for graduates, which applies to both master's and PhD. We're going to find the available scholarships, full ride if there is one, and also other venues of financial aid, such as work study, or maybe more scholarships and grants. Next, we're going to look for important requirements for international students. And we're going to also be looking for deadlines for application and other minor details for applying for financial aid for international student. Okay, let's begin this search online. We're at Google search engine and we're going to search for MIT graduate scholarships for internationals. As we have looked in the last video, you need to keep in mind that graduate programs differ, the application differs, process differs, and I think the scholarships are different for every program. So let's see, Fellowship for International Office of Graduate Education. So we're just going to open it in a new tab and we're going to see what pops up. Okay, so it's Office of Graduate Education, it's not undergraduates, so let's see. Um, okay, uh, the embassy may have an educational advisor on staff who can provide information to students who are studying for funding resources to help finance their academic programs in the U.S. So there are different uh, funds and fellowships for internationals, um, but it doesn't really say about scholarships. Let's see. Well, okay, so it has the, some of the scholarships right listed right here. Um, international fellowships are awarded. Um, for full-time study or research in the United States to women who are not United States citizens or permanent residents, both graduate and postgraduate study at credit institution are supported. So, if you want to know more, let's just click on that to see where it leads us. So, it leads us to the specific scholarship page where you can um, apply, I guess. And, and fun people, I guess. So these are, I guess, um, scholarship links for different scholarships for graduate students because it says usually at a graduate level. Um, you can see that all of this are for international students at a graduate level courses. So. This is one of the ways that you can fund your education, but I'm still going to want to see if there's another way. There are fellowships that can fund your education, but let's see, international applicants. So application and admission process for international applicants is the same for domestic applicants. English lesson. Passport entry requirement, F1 visa. So it doesn't have anything about scholarships, but we're at the official homepage. So let's just look at financial resources. Okay, financial resources. Okay, so instead of scholarships, I think they fund students by fellowships I think it's like a scholarship type but instead of scholarship they named it fellowship so these will lead to the site that we already looked at I think that is yes student finances and that is fellowship fellowship tips presidential graduate fellowship program Okay, this is, I think this is a 
a full ride scholarship, which in term is named fellowship. Presidential fellowship or nine month fellowship that fund the tuition monthly stipend and the student extended insurance plan awardness awardees for their first academic year. Students cannot apply directly for these scholarships. Okay. It doesn't really say, it doesn't say that it is only for US students. It doesn't say it's only for internationals. But let's see fellowship for internationals as we already looked at. So as you can see, I think fellowship are the only financial um, resources that international graduate applicants can apply for. And you can see the stipend rate for research, RA, and TA. And that's a lot of money right there. And the expenses, the actual expenses, um, total estimate is 76 to 91,000. So you need financial aid in order to pay for those. So I would recommend trying out one of the fellowships and applying for one so that you can um, get a scholarship or maybe you can earn a presidential graduate fellowship for free, full tuition. So this is one of the full ride scholarships that we have found during our search. And I hope this helps.